Well, hey, good luck, everybody. In our box break happening right now, we're getting ready to hit something nice in the Comet Quest box rip. Oh. And let's so let's go ahead and randomly see uh, which which box we're going to open out of the product. Seven times through. This is one twenty five. Make sure, yeah, yeah, one twenty five. Good luck, Robert L. And anything that you're in on, let's hit something big. This is the box we're going to open up. Lucky number seven. And it's box 186. 186 is popping open. Let's pull a ticket or let's hit something big in the comic itself. What do we have for the comic itself? Look at the artwork on this thing. Wow, this is very unique. Look at the artwork here. I guess that's Flash, right? It looks like a lightning bolt. That's why I think it's probably Flash. T for teen. It's just wild. Yeah, I think that's Flash. You see his lightning bolts here, too. This is a really cool-looking comic book. So uh, somebody's going to hit that, and we'll see if we can pull a bigger prize. Maybe right now. What do we have here? Ho! Oh! Spider-Man mask ticket. Oh! So the owner of these two is going to be the Hulk. Congratulations to the Hulk owner. Let me make sure I got my rules right, but I'm pretty sure it does not get random. It goes to the comic book owner. I'm almost 100% sure that's correct. That the Hulk owner gets both. The comic and the ticket for the Spider-Man mask shadow box. It's a mask, Spider-Man mask. And we just found a mask ticket. Each ticket gives the owner a 1 in 10 chance to win this signed uh, mask encased in a shadow box. And the winner will be determined by random.org for the tickets. The more tickets you collect, the better chances you have of winning the shadow, the the hit. Each ticket is valued at $80. You can buy or sell. So the random.org is for the winner of, um, is how we do the 10 tickets. A 1 in 10 chance. And the more tickets you have, the better your chance on random.org. But as far as the actual ticket being given away, it's it's given to the hit owner in the comic book product. So Comic Quest, congratulations to the Hulk owner. Who Comic Quest Hulk owner receives this Flash comic book. Mm-hmm. That is really, really cool. Congratulations. Uh, once again, to the Hulk owner. Yeah, 
Yeah, that's going to be a lot of fun uh, to see who gets that mask. And the fact that it is signed by Stan Lee and everything, really cool. Flash, Stephen K, congratulations with your Spider-Man mask ticket. And the, the really cool Flash comic book right here. So that is really neat. It's This is number 9 of 10. And once again, you can see what this looks like. You'll have a, sh a really good shot now. And it's, it's got an $80 value attached to the ticket, basically. If you maybe somebody is trying to put together all the tickets and wants to buy them all or something like that, you know, $80 a ticket is what, what it averages out to be because the shadow box is valued at $800. So it's a Stan Lee Spider Man mask encased in a custom shadow box. Okay, there's a signature. I see the signature right there now. I couldn't see where the signature was, it was right there on the mask. So Spider Man mask. Stan Lee signed. Very nice. Very cool looking. Congratulations, Stephen K. with, with uh, your hit in the uh, this one. Twenty nineteen Comic Quest Raw Edition. That was 125 and 124 is actually getting ready to go. Okay, we're going to do 124 right now. That just sold out. One twenty four is coming up. Just a small correction, it's Stephen K who has this thing, but it was it was uh, in the box. It was Hulk, and I had said Flash, so it's still the same owner, everything. But it's very important that everybody knows this is how we do these. Uh, it says Hulk and goes to Hulk, which is Stephen K. So during the, during the box break, and we're still recording, but it is the Hulk owner, Stephen K who has the Flash comic book and Spider-Man mass ticket. So we match his superhero sticker up with the uh, sticker in the box, and that's how the hit gets determined. And uh, it's not really who's on the comic book. So actually, I said that wrong, but it's the same owner that has Flash and Hulk. 